Well, I was out here pretty late last night. And I did a couple things. What was it I did? Too? Oh, I got the mirrors on. And doggone it, one of them was cracked. I don't know if it was cracked from just laying around here and getting banged around or if it was cracked when I got it or what happened or if I did it when I was working on them. But anyway, I can, I can get one, a replacement or have a glass cut for it. But uh, let's see, I got the visor on. And I had to take that thing off and beat on it. It fought me. It fought me all the way, but I got it. Uh, the uh, cooler's on. I got something else going to go on this side to kind of balance it with that cooler on there, but I'll show that later on. Anyway, what I've been doing today, I started to say this morning, but I went to bed about 4 or 5 and got about 10. So it's already afternoon, but I've been, took a sander and knocked this thing down, uh, knocked that Bondo down, and uh, I sprayed it with some brown and some green, and I, you probably can't tell in the video, but it blended in pretty good. I've got some fresh stuff right here that won't look good on the camera, but I'll knock it down. And when I when I knock it down with a sander, it, uh, at least it ain't white Bondo showing, and I don't care about dents and dings and scratches and grapes just don't want white bondo so I don't even care about bad paint um, the visor I'm gonna take it a step further later on but I'm just pushing real hard I'm trying to get to a, a cruise in Saturday night cruise in tonight and uh, <laughs> I don't know if I'll make it but I gotta I gotta get busy later So what I'm about to up and went and did right now is pull those back tires off of there uh, because I need the room to access under there to get those copper panels out between the between the fenders and the bitey right in right in right in there. I gotta get those out and polish them up. Um, and plus I need the wheels off so I have access to get under there and figure out how to attach my my welding, my fender welding. I'm not even sure how I will do that yet, but I bet I figured it out. It's kind of funny, I've learned a lot uh, since February. <laughs> uh, you know, I used to um, I used to lift that thing up about chest high, pull those tires off and set them down. Well, now I can't do that. It's too much pressure on my, on my uh, sternum. So I have to leave it low like that, and then I can just grab it with one hand and pop it off there and it falls on the ground. Getting it back on is a little tougher, but I can do it. Uh, I, I was telling my son one day up here, I said, I've learned a lot about working with levers and fulcrums and double wrenching and cheater pipes. <laughs> so, uh, you know, learning how to get by in a little different way, but we're going to still get her done. I gotta go get cleaned up and then I'll shoot a video of this thing rolling out. Starting to come together. Still got a lot to do, but when you see the fruits of your labor, it kind of gives you the courage to press on, you know? All right, that's enough.